Um, guess what? We're supposed to go to the... We're supposed to go... Ah! Whew, excuse me. We're supposed to go to the burn clinic tomorrow to get this stuff taken off my hands. But look, I found this. It says spending probably $5,000 there. $4.97 for some skin renewal recipe bar soap. It renews skin. This is like the first actual uh, thing I did since the fire. Um, plan on going back over there, make, making a vlog maybe. So you probably see it in this this vlog here, if you even see this video. Um, just sitting on the couch at my brother's house with both hands bandaged up. So Tasha's here with me. I'm glad she got off work and came down and helped me through about a week, week of this. So I'm about to get these things popped. Hopefully they let me record it. I know you guys want to see that juicy stuff. But these, if you saw the live, these things are blisters are really big. And I might, I might go ahead and videotape the whole thing for people that want to see the nastiness of it. And I'll probably put it towards the end of the video if I do. So, um, other than that, I really don't know what to say right now. I'm just trying to get a lot of stuff. You guys have been in the fire. You probably know there's like... 10,000 things you got to do within a week, probably, because just a, a lot of stuff that you got to get. Social security cards, birth certificates, um, trying to get you into your own car because you lost your key fobs. Um, so just a lot of stuff. But um, I want to thank everybody for for um, all their prayers, their donations, um, all their support. I wouldn't even believe wouldn't even believe I had this much support, so I really appreciate it all. So, um, I want to thank my brother as well for doing the GoFundMe, uh, um, the GoFundMe account, starting that off really helps out because I'm not going to be able to edit this video. This video might be two months in the future, so you might well, but you're seeing this if you're seeing this now, it might be two months in the past when I did this video. Uh, so I don't know when I when I can even edit any videos. So, hope you enjoy the video and hope you get something out of it. But I'm going to probably talk to you later when I get to the house about not going back in again for a fire and stuff like that. Because it's really, really, I stress that enough um, not to go back in. If you make it out, just stay out. So, I will uh, talk to you guys later or whatever. Cut, cut, cut. Oh, I can't do that too fast. That's what she said. Okay. Sorry, it's still all in there. That's what she said. Oh, that's what I said. Whoa, that's what I said. Whew. Okay. Well, I'm going to go on that note. Go plus stop recording. Hey, um, just found out my, um, my burns on this arm are, well, in this hand, it turned purple. Purple is not a good thing. So if they look like this, when you got a burn, a second degree burn, let me see if I can get it better. There you go. If it looks like that, second degree burn, then I'm not gonna say that looks good, but you just don't want it to turn purple like this. Just happened maybe a day ago, but I've been getting 102.7.9 uh, temperature. So I need to get antibiotics for it. Uh, the other hand is right here. It's just that one busted, so yeah, it's not looking too great, guys. But uh, it's going to hurt later because they're going to take the skin. They're going to take the skin off this on Monday. Um, so once it heals up like that, you got to keep it, keep it lubricated. That's what she said. But uh, or it'll hurt even worse. 
that's what she said too um but i'm going to go ahead and uh go to urgent care now which i don't want to spend any more money but i'm going to go ahead and do this because tasha's nagging on me but this is uh, infected so i'm gonna get antibiotics and it's about all right mm -hmm. so okay let's get in here go post stop recording all right he deflated these a little bit uh, but this is this infected um I don't know, he ain't gonna do too much with these since they got the black on there. I don't think he wants to infect that. But, there we go. I was gonna do this myself. I could have done this myself, put needles in them and nope. whatever. But, but I have to get my, my antibiotics and uh, get out of here. I asked him if I could record on this GoPro thing, but, uh, um, he didn't, he wasn't fond of that. So, I'm gonna cut the GoPro thing out of there. Let me show it up though. Yeah, the back of it looks nasty. Well, those two, that's the one that's really infected anyway. Nope. You have it guys, I'm gonna go to Walmart and get the antibiotics and some other stuff I need to shave a little bit. But I'll shave you. Okay. You shut up. Hey guys, um we are on our way to um my house had burnt down. Um, we're about to go live, but when you're seeing this, uh, we're it already went live. So if you haven't checked it out, just be in for a shock because uh, it's a little different. Done a little decorating, uh, but both of my hands are burnt. Um, there was a live right before that in my brother's basement. I went live. If you want to check that one out as well, to fill you in exactly more what's going on. Uh, but we're going back there to go live just one last time and just to show you the difference from then and now. Um, I don't know where I'm going to be moving to next. So I'm not even thinking about that yet. Just thinking about what I need to get done today. So security guards and stuff like that. Um, so we're going to do this, um, go out to eat and then do a lot of more running around getting all my life back in order. Well, no, not like I've been drinking and like that, but get all my paperwork and everything, okay? So, thanks for everybody for their continued support, prayers, donations, everything. Um, I really do appreciate it. A lot of support. Um, I know I'll probably say that a lot in this video. So, um, probably because I mean it. So. so, thank you very much, guys, and let's get over to my house. I was going to update you um, this morning when I was at the house, but I, I um, got a lot of stuff going on, um, as you can imagine, or not. Uh, we're here at uh, Cahokia Motors. Uh, real great people. They have a, a car dealer in Cahokia. I know they say a lot of car dealerships in Cahokia aren't no good, but these people actually, this is one of the tow truck drivers actually, he was out there like seven in the morning passing by and he pulled my car from the driveway uh, so it wouldn't burn up and they're actually gonna tow it for free to go get the key files made and um, I really need that out. I've been trying to get this since the house fire, what, about four or five days ago. I've been trying to get this car out of there because that's pretty much all I own. So um, we're doing that now, and then um, I'm gonna take some videos inside the house. We did go live, you wanna check that video out of, uh, uh, it's called, It's Not Worth It, but cause I, I went back in to try to get another phone and don't do that, uh, my cell phone. But uh, I'm gonna go do a quick video inside of here because the live was pixelated, but the signal wasn't that great. Um, and then go to the burn, the burn center to cut all this, to cut all this out um, all the dead skin and 
it's this is going to be the part that's going to hurt so that's what i said all right pulled up Ooh, scene. thank you huh Pull up to the scene with the yeah. I, I said pull up to the scene. She goes with the ceiling missing. That's a two chain, two chain song. Pull up to the scene with my ceiling missing. Pull up to the scene with my ceiling missing. Okay, walking in here now. Um, yeah, here's all my Crocs. I got there's well some of them. I got a lot of them in the house. None of them made them. So actually, I don't own a pair of Crocs until I go to the PO, PO box. But. I'm gonna go into this side of the house and I'll show you my room last. But this is the kitchen where we usually do, we usually do the lives at. Uh, we did put that, that sign there because we went live real quick. And that's Bob Notorious B.O.B.'s cup. Uh, yeah, the towel made it. We dry stuff off with. The cabinets used to be that color. The floors, yeah, the beautiful floors are not there anymore. We do got some, I don't want to touch anything in here because uh, Tasha would yell at me. Here's the front room. No more treadmill there. Uh, the green screen is not too green. And that's not smoke, guys. That's just my breath. I usually keep it this temperature in here anyway, so I'm not used to that. I'm not worried about that. Um, my daughter's room pretty much got a lot of smoke damage. Uh, a lot of smoke damage. Um, I think the most valuable thing in here was her camera for school. Uh, she's going to school doing photography. The bathroom, I didn't even go in here yet. I'm sorry, kick it open. Nope. Uh, here's her, my daughter's other room. Those are the almost best room. This best room, this room here. Uh, it has the Christmas stuff in it. This room pretty much was the room that didn't really get messed with except a lot of smoke damage. Got my pickles. Yeah, and this is a grow. I made this out of a bunk bed. This is for my tomato plants and stuff when I did my garden. So I made some grow lights and everything in there. Yes, just for that, folks. You can grow more stuff than just one kind of plant. Uh, so here's the front room. Um, also, I'll show you the, the hallway where I ran back down the second time to come back in to get a cell phone to at least call people, but... Uh, I didn't make it, but to about right here, and I turned around because I got a big whiff of uh, toxic smoke in me, and I had to get back out. Um, I couldn't see. It was pitch black once I turned around. It was pitch black in there. Uh, it wasn't pitch black until I ran this way, and then I turned around. It was pitch black already, so it goes really quick. And this is my room. The garage is on that side there where that blue, that blue thing's at. So it's it's that wall's about gone. Uh, my bed was right under that window. The fire was about right there in that corner. So from there to there, my head was. Uh, got a new skylight here and one over there by the kitchen. Uh, there's my garbage disposal shirts and jackets. I had a, a lot of them, folks, a lot of them. I had probably $3,000 worth of them sitting there at the inventory I just had got. Uh, but that is that folks uh, I'm going to get out of here I got other stuff to do I go to the burn center <sighs> so that sucks hey, we're in our uh, mobile office uh, because of the conditions um, but yes we are um, have my secretary over here she's volunteer 
volunteer. Yo, I'm in. Oh, now she figured out she's volunteer. Uh, as packages I got off, these are from eBay, folks. eBay. So, um, yes, I do have my shirts and hoodies on eBay. Um, I've I've got a whole shipment of shirts and hoodies, so uh, I'm ready to uh, ship them out, and I'm getting them out as soon as possible. Uh, if you're overseas, uh, look online on the eBay under my descriptions, okay? Um, but um, I do have them as well. You can use uh, PayPal. Uh, if you're in the U.S., uh, you can use Venmo, Cash App, or my P.O. Box. Uh, so I will be shipping, the, I'm shipping these out as um, soon as I can, as soon as I get the payment, and as soon as I can get to the uh, post office within probably two days of, of, of paying for them, um, I do get them out as soon as possible. So, um, again, I appreciate you guys. We're going to go in here at this restaurant here called The Beast. It's a good barbecue place around Belleville, Illinois. But totally two different kind of tastes, though, probably. I think y'all do, well, Memphis do kind of a sweet barbecue, but y'all's is like super sweet. Mm. I don't know. Curl, curl. Barbecue is barbecue. Yeah. It depends on how you like it. Just like I like the vinegary vinegary yeah, type sauce South sauces Carolina, over. Like the mustard sauce. I mean, I eat the you. sweet, yeah, I eat the sweet sauces, but I like, like I was telling you, like the Topps barbecue style sauce. I think they do like a either mustard or vinegar type sauce. Okay, let's get in here. I'm hungry. Hey guys, I got the triple pig. This is the snoot. The, the tips and the hot worst. Um, she, what did you get? Burnt ends and Bur mac and cheese. Burnt ends and mac and cheese. So let me go ahead and shut up and put this next slow, sexy music in here. Okay, just, um, just got done eating at the Beast. Um, like I said, I had the triple pig. Is it called triple pig? Mm -hmm. um, yeah, the snoot, the um, hot worst, and uh, rib tips. Rib tips. And potato salad. And potato salad. It was all delicious. Uh, I really like the chainsaw hot sauce thing. It's a hot barbecue. It's, it's pretty good. Um, and uh, they had something called the standard. It was a little sweeter, vinegar based. Uh, good sauces. Uh, you had the um, burnt ends. Burnt ends yeah. They was burnt. They was burnt ends. They, was a little, they were good. They were good. Uh, the smaller burnt ends, though, there uh, there was a little more burnt than the other ones, like a little drier. I think uh, there was. I guess it wasn't uniform sizes, is probably, but because the ones that she didn't want, like when she was done eating, she was full. One of them was really freaking moist because it's bigger. So it's uh, so when you try to cook, I'm not trying to tell the beast how to do it, but like when I try to cook, I try to like potato salad or anything, you want everything to be the same size. So when you cook it, it cooks evenly instead of one get cooked too much and one not enough. So off to get to uh, the post office to deliver the packages uh, from the um, t-shirt and hoodie sales. And then we're going to be in pain for a while, so I'm not even know if I can do this, this snoot. I was going to do a snoot for you guys, uh, a live snoot. Maybe you could feed me I've if I'm not in too much pain. Okay, so get, guys, check that video out. It's probably it's going to be already out when you, by the time you see this video here, because uh, this has to be edited. So I'll probably go live and do a question and answer and eat a, a pig snoot for you guys. Headed in here now to uh, get some um, skin taken off. So like when somebody says, give you some skin, they're not uh, talking about this.
right now your skin's kind of acting as a protector. Um, but we need, I'm gonna let him do that. He's probably gonna cut some of the skin off. Um, so that on your skin can develop. Anymore. So you gotta just maybe cut a V out and try to keep it on there still, but I don't know. I don't know, we'll see what he wants to do. He might take it all off. Okay. So that fresh skin can grow underneath and kind of breathe. So right now it's just kinda, yeah. there's not even any. <laughs> All right, happy again, love you shortly, okay? Okay, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. All right. Can I see Which way is the light best up? Right there. Or going this way is the light, yeah, there we go. All right, guys, here's, here's the hand that they're about to do, and here's the one that they are doing. I was there, I was thinking, I know this right here. This actually it says already healing right there, but right here, the red part, uh, yeah, Freddy Krueger there. Okay. All right, well, there you go, guys. I'm gonna wait till I guess we get bandaged up about. Um, I don't, you know, like you said, he doesn't want me to take pictures of him doing it. I know some people might say, that's kind of like a like a lawsuit type thing. If you, you know, somebody might do one little bitty thing wrong. So I'm not trying to get uh, get anybody in trouble here. I just want my hand fixed. <laughs> so, uh, okay, well, we'll see you in a little bit. All right, just got done and here's some, uh, Here's the new product here. Uh, actually, um, Tasha said she saw these things before. I'm not trying to flip you guys off, um, but she said you, she uses these little finger sock things for um, chicken liver for fishing. So hopefully, I told them to give me the extras instead of giving them to her because she probably use them for fishing and not my fingers. Or, oh, you don't need those. Uh, she wouldn't do that. Waiting for to use the restroom, and we're headed out of here, going back uh, to my brother's house. Uh, probably go live later and do the uh, pig snoot for you guys. So uh, that video's already out, so check that out. I'm probably just going to name it Pig Eating Pig Snoot. I don't know what else to say, but you got to try it. If you ain't from St. Louis, when you come through St. Louis, try it. It's real crispy. If it's not crispy, do not eat it, okay? So if it's crispy, it's like pork rinds, part pork rinds, that's what it tastes like. It's like a honeycomb on the inside, a dense honeycomb, really delicious. And it's hard on the outside, like really hard. That's what she said. Go post, stop recording. Hey guys, I have hoodies in. The name brand are independent, so you know they are thick and high quality. I am have them all the way from small to 3X, uh, only in black right now, so just go ahead and look in descriptions for that. Uh, I do have uh, t-shirts as well. The name brand of the t-shirts are Canvas. Uh, they are thick, they are soft, the logo wipes off like a bib, just like on the hoodie. So if you want those, please check in descriptions. Uh, they all are pre-washed materials, so they won't shrink on you. So check in descriptions for the price and the uh, shipping and handling of that, because I do ship in U.S. and in Canada. If you haven't already, um, hit follow on The Garbage Disposal on Facebook and follow me there to get more pictures and stuff. Uh, please subscribe to my page. Hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming videos. And hit the like button if you like it. Other than that, please share it with your friends, family, and even your boss. Have a great day, unless you made other plans.